Series 1580 Intercom Systems The Series 1580 system is designed to support audio-only, single operator systems that serve one or two lanes. Two kits are available. The 1580HS has an operator handset. The 1580S does not. The Model 1580 counterstation looks identical to the Model 1500A counterstation except for the keypad, which shows Series 1580. The Model 1583 lane station is similar to the 1520, but it has connections for two lanes instead of one. If your system only has one lane, use the connections on the left half of the 1583. Video is not supported for Series 1580, and the 1580 system cannot be expanded or connected to Series 1500 hubs, lane stations, or counter stations. The 1580S kit consists of one Model 1580, one Model 1583, and a 571-043 power supply or similar. To complete the system, the necessary lane, microphones, speakers, call button switches, and shielded cable for one or two customer positions or drive-up lanes must be purchased separately. Mount the 1583 on a flat surface inside the building near the counter station. Connect the counter station to the lane station using Cat5 cable. Connect the power supply to the lane station unless there's no AC outlet nearby. In that case, the system may be powered through the counter station. If the Cat5 cable is extremely long, it may be necessary to power both the counter station and the lane station. The lane station power light should be blinking rapidly. A slow blink means the lane station is not connected to the counter station. Check the Cat5 cable. Before you wire each lane port to its respective speaker, microphone, and call button, disconnect the power supply from the outlet. The cable that connects the lane station to the speaker, mic, and call button must be shielded, paired cable. For most installations, you can use 4-pair 18-gauge cable, but it must have an overall foil shield. Use shielded paired cable with 3 to 6 twisted pairs of conductors, depending on your configuration, to connect the Model 1583 dual lane station to the lane, microphone, speaker, and call button. The drain wire on the lane end of the cable must be trimmed off and not connected to anything. Always use one twisted pair for microphone and one for speaker to maintain audio quality. For proper system operation, one of the lane common terminals must also be connected to a good ground, such as an electrical box or a metallic structural member, using the green ground wire. NO, normally open, contacts are used for any device, such as a door latch or solenoid, that must be operated from the counter station. If audio program content will be playing at the lane station positions when customers are on hold or while the lane is idle, plug the audio player into the program input ports on the 1583. Program audio level may be manually adjusted on the 1583. Each lane's program audio may be turned off during idle periods, still heard while on hold using the 1550A program audio abate setting. Connect Audio Authority's Model 1547B traffic sensor to traffic one or two. When a vehicle triggers the 1547B, the counter station generates a call tone, just like pressing the call button does. To extend a traffic sensor cable, use an RJ45 coupler and a length of Cat5 cable. The lane station provides a contact for third-party traffic sensing devices. Connect the sensor to pin 6 and the common ground wire to pin 8. Touch and hold the setup key without a 1550A connected. The lights next to camera up and down, volume up and down keys illuminate. Touch camera up and down to select one of 16 ringtones. 
Touch volume up or down to set the ring volume. Select privacy, the light comes on. And touch volume up or down to set handset and or wireless headset volume. To make further adjustments to handset, transmit or receive volume, use the two knobs on the underside of the 1580 counter station. One is for transmit and the other is for receive. The 1550A setup tool is required to perform advanced setup. See lesson 10 for instructions and refer to the 1580 menu tree to navigate. That's it for series 1580. The next lesson, advanced setup using the 1550A setup tool.